the wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Manchester United, they face Liverpool and it's coming up live on EA TV next. Well, there is nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crown. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by the former Arsenal and England defender Lee Dixon. It is Manchester United taking on Liverpool. Well, it's an absolute pleasure, Derek, to be here. Very, very lucky indeed to be broadcasting to millions and millions of people, let alone watching this fantastic game. I'm sure the players are a little bit nervous as well with that audience looming in the background, tuning in on their televisions. It's going to be a great night. I'm very excited to be here. Hopefully we get the game that this tournament deserves. Options in the centre. Magnificent defending. Here's the lineup for Manchester United. 4 3 3, but perhaps not as we usually know it. So, a very narrow look about the forward line and a strong three in midfield. The width going forward will be provided by the full backs. Who will... He takes aim. A case of foiling the opposition by whatever means. Nkunku. Relentless high pressing. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Well, as a defender, you can't afford to take your eyes off Anthony Martial, even for a fleeting moment. In what way might he contribute in this match, Lee? Well, basically, you've got to keep him out of the box because he's got such a brilliant finishing ability that you give him half a yard, he will score. So keep him as far away from your goal as possible. Well, I must say, he acquitted himself well under pressure. And space on the wing for Liverpool. Andrew Robertson... Fabinho, oh, tremendous vision, Salah, Salah will know that the pass needed to be slightly better, can they hit on the break? He's using his strength to good effect, Mane, given away, oh a nice looking pass, now Paul Pogba, Looked as though United were going to make it 1 0. Not so. Oh, it's a great chance. A great chance for the opening goal. He's just missed. Here's Gruic. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. And Mohamed Salah now. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Mane, whatever it takes to keep them out. No difficulties encountered by De Gea. Deli Alli now. Aaron Wan-Bissaka. Pogba has it. Fabian. Rashford. Rashford. Alex Tevez. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. No nonsense clearance. Martial. And now, will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead? In it goes for Manchester United, who are in the driving seat in this final. Well, when you've got a game plan and you go a goal behind, Manchester United in front, you have to change that game plan. Well, it's good build up with his one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. So back underway in this game, Manchester United with the advantage. Nkunku has it. Suso. It is a decent looking attack here. Well, as you can see, United haven't had too much of the ball, but they won't mind without the win in this game. They're a delightful pass. Sancho.
Fabinho now. Salah. A bit sloppy in possession. I think everyone knew that was foul play. And the referee left with little choice but to award the free kick. And that will mean a caution. Well, definitely a yellow card, Derek. Deli Alli now. Rashford. Pogba. And he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Throw in to Manchester United. Pogba. Deli Alli. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Well, they are on the wrong end of the scoreline, but Lee, your overall thoughts on their current situation? Well, Liverpool find themselves still very much in this game. Such fine margins between success and failure at this level. They need to stick to the game plan and hope it turns around in that second half. Well, as the attacking side, you might dispute it, but offside by a hair. Yeah, spot on from the linesman. Spot on, but he was close. It's with Alex Tenez. Fabian. Pogba has it. It's with Milan Skriniar. Juan Bisaka. Sancho now. The fourth official has indicated... The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Nkunku. Liverpool obsessed with finding a forward gear. Now, what can they do from this position? And there's the whistle. Half time it is. A ready. <laughs> 45 minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Here's Christensen, Fabinho, Nkunku, he's found a pocket of space, and they just let his opponent glide by, Suso with it, Grujic, every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. It's with Milan Skriniar. Pogba. Fabian. Well, quite a few reports this morning in the sports blogs and tabloids that Paris Saint-Germain may be getting an exciting new addition to their squad league. Well, Derek, there's normally no smoke without fire. The rumours have been rife. The fans will be excited about that. He's a proper player, isn't he? I'd sign him. Grujic. Robertson might be able to get in behind the defence. Pogba. And Pogba with the pass here. Sancho. Is this the moment? And it's come off the keeper. And thumped away. And a substitution in the offing. Sancho now. Deli Alli. Fabian, Alex Tellez, and a very good challenge. Well, this is Liverpool at their best. They love possession of the ball, but it's just whether they can convert that possession into clear-cut chances. You sense they need to pick up the pace a little, start utilising the wide areas more. The back line's doing a decent job. Hopefully the forwards can do that as well. This is Salah. Fabinho. Good technique displayed. Here's Robertson. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. And now they have the ball back. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. 
Now just couldn't keep the ball. He continues his run. Robertson. Crossing opportunity. And possession lost, intercepted. Counter-attacking very much an option. And he's made headway. The net is staring him in the face. And a goal here for Manchester United. They are the big favourites now. Well, as we see, counter-attacking football at its purest, superb use of pace, a fabulous goal. So, 2-0 now. A move of promise on the flank. Martial. And he put the cross into the right place, but no one able to finish it off. And Kunku. And Pogba taking charge defensively. Now Paul Pogba. Sancho. And that's an important intervention. But he took care of it defensively. Sancho now. Deli Alley. Alex Tellez has it. It's been a thoroughly cogent and convincing performance in this match, Lee. Well, creatively, United have been great tonight. Imagination, delivery, execution, top draw performance. Martial! Goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. I cannot believe he's kept that out the net. Absolutely amazing. Plenty of running room in the wide position. Santimina, Salah. Now Santimina. Nkunku has it. Going well. Well, great read there to intercept. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Jaden Sancho. Is it going to end up being productive for them? We wondered who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. One minute remaining. And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up, win medals, absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. It's a proud moment for any footballer, and they know what's about to occur, the presentation of old Big Ears, Lee. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not so sure that's a very nice title for that trophy. It's a brilliant trophy, and the captain now is going to get possibly the best moment of his career, the chance to lift the Champions League. Manchester United have the cup. feelings that these players get now might never be repeated again. Enjoy every moment. And the party continues as the players celebrate with their adoring supporters who have made the trip here. Enjoy it, boys. Stay on that pitch as long as you possibly can. United, a team with a rich history. In this competition going all the way back to 1968 when they beat Benfica at Wembley. Well, all that hard work along the way in this tournament 
all comes together at the end when you pick the trophy up. Just look at them celebrating. A brilliant moment. Hard work indeed, Lee. The trophy now in their possession.